guys welcome to boxing block center the home of nigerian african boxing and please if you're new to this channel make sure you click the like and of course the subscribe right now so let's just get straight to it with our station francis ngano the predator according to the recent news is actively seeking to prove his worth in boxing by expressing his desire to face face the winner of the Deontay water versus Janjali matchup Demonstrating his determination to complete to compete at the highest level and earn recognition among the sports elite competitors. So Ngano, we know, said that he he's not gonna retire. Like he said he wasn't gonna retire from boxing. That he's he wants to continue. Um yesterday I watched the Ngano Fury fight. I think Joshua caught Ngano at the right time. I think Joshua's power was the main it was the main difference between him between the Ngano um fight with Fury and Ngano fight with Joshua. It was the main difference basically. Cuz I was that fight. <clears throat> I tell you right now. Tas Fury landed bombs on Ngano. Right hands the same the same right hand he landed on water, he landed bombs after bombs after bombs. Ngono took all of those punches with, 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 like, with no effect basically. He just took it and kept on walking forward. Joshua landed a bomb on Ngano. Ngano felt it. Ngano got hurt. Like he felt it and he was like, whoa, this is a different power. Ngano might not agree to this, but re the reason um, Joshua beat Ngano is because Joshua punches way harder than um, Tyson Fury. Because Fury landed the same punches, but Ngano did feel it, even, including an elbow, basically. So it means Joshua is an underrated puncher, bro. But Ngano wanted to fight. The winner of Wada Janjali is very interested. I think the SSLC SS can get a mate. That'll be back to back, you know, back to back three times, you know, against top elite heavyweight, basically. What do you make? What do you think of Ungano's, um, you know, desire to like to fight? Water on uh, um, Janjali. Man, I think Unganu. I don't think Unganu could be up to par with the, uh, especially people who are ex who are fundamentally sound. Okay, that would be a problem for him because there's big difference between. Uh, combat mixed martial arts versus boxing. All right, big big difference. If he thinks he's gonna go in there to do something like that to a Zhang Zhilei, it's gonna be an issue for him because hopefully he does have actual knockout power in boxing. You know, because if 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 it's found out that he doesn't have it, it's gonna be it's gonna it's is that that one card he holds as in like okay the guy's a dangerous fighter he's still extremely tough would be gone that 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 the card that he holds as has you know having that energy like let's he's he's a, he's a main attraction let's book him it's gonna be gone if they find out so it'll be smart to use that accordingly right and make big fights instead of getting exposed and not being able to do it because it looked like Zhang kind of, Zhang is is the is the upset king I would say he has the making of being one or making of really making you look real bad make uh, uh, Zhang has the power of making you look having to expose you Okay, because Zhang has fought some fighters who are also, who are decent, 
boxers, you know, and and Francis Ngannou not even being a good boxer at that is going to be an issue because if he goes in there and says, let me fight Zhang and he gets found out, it's going to be, like I said, who's going to want to hold him, who's going to want to promote him for boxing? Nobody. You know, yeah, make your money, but do it the right way and be done. Because boxing, at the end of the day, is still a dangerous sport. Same thing if you fight Wilder. Hey, man, don't find out that Wilder has a nasty, nasty right hand to the last minute. Don't you don't want to you don't want to find that out. And Wilder has one of the best jabs in the in the division. Okay, just don't let that fool you. Just because Wilder Wilder has been beat, you know, even by by um uh uh. Joseph Parker, you know, I, I would prefer him to fight a Joseph Parker, Joe Joyce, you know, those little guys to show us something before he even attempts at fundamentally sound big heavyweights. You know, I prefer him to do that instead of just trying to do something else. But that's where I'm going to end it, bro. Man can't wait though bro I, I think Ngono has a future in boxing I just think so bro you have to re rewatch that uh, that fear in Ngono fight back just rewatch it this guy has a future in boxing but the age I'm only concerned about the age you know is basically up there already now so it's crazy man anyways guys a lot of you subscribe you've heard it from our brother Todd Jackway but we'll just give you guys nothing but re share right here god bless you all for always support the channel and stay tuned for more cheers guys Take care. <laughs>